everybody. I know this video has been requested a million times and it's taking me forever, but it's a room tour slash makeup organization. And I thought I wasn't gonna do a room tour, but I'll do a mini room tour because I just got done organizing. I've been posting on my Facebook how I've been organizing every day. So this is my new setup for where I do my makeup. I wanted like my girl sanctuary. So it's like, here's the entrance to my bedroom. And that coat hanger used to be there where that white thing is. And this used to be in a corner over there with the printer just collecting junk. So then I thought, let me make this my dresser so I don't have to buy one. So there's me, hi. I'm in gym clothes, sorry. All right, so this is my little desk. It's really old, it was my boyfriend's grandfather and it has a little drawer here. Down there I keep my makeup kit for when I go do freelance work. And here I just keep my face brushes that I use every day or, you know, the most. Keep a magnified mirror here with two sides that I got at the dollar store. Here I keep, next to the mirror, this little three drawer set. Eyeliners at the bottom. My everyday eyeshadow, not everyday, but the ones I use the most. And up here, the most used lip products. Up here, just a couple. These are not all. These are just a couple of my eye brushes to do simple makeup. My hairbrush, the eyeliners, and an eyeliner brush. And here, I keep all my, my foundations. Not all, but just my drugstore slash the ones I like to use the most. And my Fix Plus. There's a couple foundation samples. This little clear vinyl thingy is from Caboodles from Target. And in there I keep all my mascaras, just little things, cotton balls, um, tweezers, all that good stuff. And up there I have a cork board. Not a, I have two cork boards up there. A marker board with this little cute magnet thing that I got at uh, Target. And if you come down here, have another three drawer system, but it's a little bigger than this one, so you can see the difference. And in here I keep all my eyeshadows, which is not that much. I have this eyeshadow palette by Too Faced, which I got at Urban, no, yes, Urban Outfitters on sale for like $10, and it's like a $40 palette. So I, I hope they get the natural one so that then they can put it on sale. And just like, there's a little bit of everything in here, all the e.l.f., Wet and Wild, Cover Girl. There's a couple MAC ones in there, but my MAC ones are in my everyday use one. Second drawer, and I just reorganized this like two days ago, so I'm really excited about this. Um, lip liners and lip products. Lipsticks, not lip glosses. And the next drawer is all lip glosses, which is not crazy. I try to not stash up on things because you just collect junk. And if you would have seen all the things I threw away from clothes to makeup, it was a lot. And I'll show you guys my closet, which I just reorganized as well. And this top drawer is concealers. This was actually, this divider thing was a box from a gift set from Bath & Body Works that I got for Christmas. So I, I saved that because it didn't fit before because this storage system with five drawers, I just got at Target. I used to have this one. And I used to keep my makeup if I do a 360 it, over there in my dresser. But you see, I have nowhere to sit. And if I sit on the bed, it has a hard ledge. So it was uncomfortable. And I really wanted like a sit-down spot to get ready. So the next door is face powders and face products that aren't um, foundation. So here we have e.l.f. E.l.f. blushes. These are powders and bronzers. I have a Benefit Coralista, which is favorite blush, my mineralized skin finishes, and back there we have Studio Fix, there's a Hello Kitty powder back there, and these little white thingies I got at Target in the kitchen drawer section, and they come in different sizes, like there's another size here, you see, like this one, and in here I have MAC blushes, cream blush, my Stila, Stila, uh, and another blush. Oh, this is, what is this? Oh, cream color base. See, I don't really use that that often. And my blush brush in here. I always like to do that. And I, down here. Oh, down here, we just have miscellaneous 
face products, e.l.f. Uh, little three in ones that are lovely on NARS. Some drugstore and non drugstore bronzers. Maybe it's like a bronzer. And then their respective brushes. I should take this one out and clean it and keep it in my other drawer. Down here, you see, I haven't even. I'm, I'm, I'm like wanting to go buy more makeup so I can fill this up. These are just all samples from Sephora, the little kids that you buy that have little deluxe samples, all that stuff. Down here, I keep my brush roll with my brushes that I use to go on freelance work. And this drawer is not done being organized yet, but right now I have Q-tips, makeup removers, um, high definition powder, which I should move this to the other drawer. And that's a, a palette. I don't like to keep my palettes put away, like as you can see I have my MAC one on top. So, we'll see. Here's my nail drawer, which is a mess. It used to be organized, but I try to keep nail polishes, nail tools, and I really don't use this drawer because I get my nails done every week, religiously. Like, I just got them done today. I just got back a little bit ago. And the bottom drawer is just a junk drawer with bags, etc., etc. This I could even add on more makeup to, but I just reorganized. This was a messy, messy drawer. But I'm really excited about that. And over here, you know, this is all still in the works. Here, I keep a lamp. I'm gonna, I want to start making videos here. Here we have just, this is the e.l.f. brush holder, the large one. And here's my spot brush cleanser, which I use all the time. Cle uh, hand sanitizer, I always like to keep handy. Just some testers and stuff. Nothing crazy yet. And then, in here, let's turn on the lights, is my closet, which I just reorganized. Like, you see how there's even empty shelf space? I didn't even have that before. It was completely, completely full. Um, a way to save space that I found out. So if you guys have these empty, you see these holes here? You can stick your heels in them. Only certain thin heels fit. But it makes your heels a lot nicer. Up there I put some purses and luggage, which used to be hung on that rack. That's why it looked so messy before. I folded my jeans. I folded all these are dresses by color, skirts, and then all tops and sweaters over there. So now I even have space. I put all my gym clothes in this thing, which used to just be a junk collector. But yeah, semi-organized shoes. I'm very happy. And in here, in this linen closet here, I keep my jewelry. Another thing of drawers. And this is a really good idea I've been wanting to show you guys. If you have an empty wall and you want to make a cheap way to hang your necklaces and stuff, these are just push pins. See? Look at that, and I have a whole wall full of them. They're the easiest way to hang your stuff. So yeah guys, and that's my bathroom over there. We have this little hallway here, and there we are. There's my iPad just hanging out on the bed. It's not worth it, don't buy it. Waste of money, just get a laptop. So yeah guys, I hope you enjoyed. I hope to make some new videos very soon. See you guys soon, bye.